Sup guys, RhinoGT4 here bringing you my newest Let's Play of ATV Off-Road Fury for the PlayStation 2. And, um, yeah, this is a uh, fun series developed by Rainbow Studios and published by THQ, which sadly is no more. But I, <coughs> excuse me, I enjoy the ATV Off-Road Fury series personally. Well, any of the uh, Rainbow Studios games, really. But uh, let's let's just get right to it, shall we? And uh, so this game, there isn't really a whole lot to this game, the first installment. I don't know why. I guess it was just their first forte and whatever. There are four different race types and a pro career mode. I will be going through this LP since we're doing the ma well. The pro career consists of the Max Nationals and the Stadium Supercross. I'll be doing the pro career and then. At some other point, I'll be doing a freestyle and enduro races as well. So, yeah. But for now, for the first segment, we're going to start the game with the training um, session. Because why the fuck not? Training mode. And, yeah. Probably should have reset the game because I was kind of fucking around before I actually started recording to uh, get the... Uh, because the first time you boot up the game, you get the, uh, control. Welcome to the training course. We're going to teach you several techniques to help you get the most out of the game. We'll be using the default controls for the training course. That means the X button is gas, and the square button is brake. See the arrows painted on the track? They indicate how to get to the next checkpoint. Each checkpoint is a circle with a number painted on the ground, just like the one under your ATV. Your first task is to stop when you reach circle number two, Press the X button to give your bike some gas, and press the square button to brake in circle number two. Do it now. Anyways, before I got interrupted, it, the first screen is the control screen, which this tutorial will explain everything, so I don't really need to. Well done. Now you're going to navigate a right-hand hairpin turn. Use the left analog joystick or the directional pad to steer your ATV around the turn. When making a turn, sometimes it's helpful to drift to the outside of the curb and ride the berm around the turn. Now follow the arrows, drive around the turn, and stop when you reach circle number three. And yeah, so commentary is going to be kind of lacking this segment because it's mostly going to be the tutorial guy speaking. Good. In front of you is a simple jump, followed by a left-hand turn. When taking a jump, it's often best to land on all four tires at once. You can do this by adjusting the pitch of your ATV in midair. Pitch the ATV by pressing forward and back on the left analog joystick or the directional pad. Now give the ATV some gas, and as you fly through the air, press forward to land your ATV as level to the ground as possible. After the left hand turn, stop in circle number four. Go for it! Go for it, let's go! Yeah. This just teaches the basics of the game. Figured I'd show it off, because why the fuck not? It is a tutorial. Those that aren't familiar with the game will get to do that. Why nice. do you do that? Some jumps are bigger than others. In order to clear big jumps, you need to learn how to preload the suspension to make the bike fly further. To preload the suspension, pull back on the left analog joystick at the bottom of the jump, then snap the left analog joystick forward before your tires leave the ground. If you do it correctly, the preload meter will show a red bar indicating how much lift you've achieved, and your ATV will sail through the air further than usual. When the conditions are right to preload, the meter will light up with a green background. Try it now. Remember to pull back on the left analog joystick at the bottom of the jump, then snap it forward before your wheels leave the ground. After you've landed, drive around the turn and stop in circle number five. Okay, hit it. All right. This guy talks a lot. Anyways, preloading suspension, very important part of the game. But, eh, I'll, I'll actually speak about stuff in the next segment, goddammit. Great. Now you're going to learn how to ride a wheelie. To pop a wheelie, hit the gas and pull back on the left analog joystick. Try to hold the wheelie for a few seconds, then hit the brakes and come to a stop inside circle number six. Wheelies, yeah. Good job! It looks like you've got your basic driving skills under control. Sometimes, you'll bump into objects in the world and need to back up. To drive in reverse, press and hold the gas and the brake button at the same time. 
You can look back by holding down the L2 button. Go ahead and press gas and brake together to start driving in reverse. Hold down L2 if you want to look back as you drive. Drive in reverse all the way back to circle number five. Do, 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 backing up. Oh my god, this is so fucking slow. Eh. Okay, now it's time to bust a trick. To perform a stunt, first you need to get some really big air. Once you're airborne, press the left analog joystick or directional pad in any direction while pressing either the triangle or the circle button. Take the jump in front of you and pull off a trick, then continue on through the finish gate. All right, and time to pull off a kind of meaningless trick for this game. It's really not important, unless in freestyle, but it doesn't matter. Well done. You've learned the basics of handling your ATV. Here's one final test before you go. Take a lap around the course without going off track. If you go off track, we'll reset you from the start. So pay attention. Good luck. So anyways, as f if you're familiar with my LPs, you may know I'd like to do like first person cameras because it helps me with control. Well, let's just go through the camera presets, shall we? There's this. 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 Eh. I don't like this at all. Very high camera angle. And then there's this. I'm going to be using this camera angle because it's, I don't know. It's the first one, it feels the best for me. I don't really care. Congratulations. Looks like you're ready for some off-road fury. Off-road fury. I don't know why, I, I kind of like that. Pretty cool. Anyways, that was the training thing. The training course, tutorial, whatever. So, this was kind of a pointless segment, I know, but eh, we got it out of the way, and, uh, you now know pretty much the basics of the game if you've never seen this played this before so next time we'll be starting the pro career Maxis National shiz so uh yeah stay tuned <laughs>